Today I'll show you how to turn your old tablet into a second monitor for your computer. If your device has access to the Play Store, open it and download a utility called Space Desk. Basically, you'll install it both on your computer and on your tablet and they will communicate with each other. Now I've already installed it here. The software is still in beta and it expires every year, so make sure to keep it updated until the RTM version is released. If your device is too old for Google Play, you can use your computer to find an APK file or an Android package and transfer it to your tablet. Then you should enable unknown sources and settings and sideload the app by opening the APK. The interface is simple, you just need to select your computer or IP address and it's ready. There are some settings you can configure, so explore. Now let's go to the computer and install Space Desk Primary Server. Open your browser and go to spacedesk.net. Space Desk Primary Server is supported on Windows 10 and 11, though an older beta is available for Windows 8.1 and 7. Scroll down until you find the download buttons. Make sure to select Driver Software for Windows Primary PC, then choose your architecture, most probably 64-bit, and download the installer. Now let's install the program. First, accept the license agreement. Then, choose where you will install the program. I recommend leaving the default location. Let the installer add an exception to your Windows firewall, else the program won't run. Now click on Install. After a few seconds, Space Desk will be installed. If you want, you can open it in order to configure different settings, but at this point it should work like plug and play. It will appear in the taskbar tray and you can stop the service with this console. It's time to connect the PC and the tablet. Open Space Desk Viewer on your mobile device. Make sure to connect both the server and the client to the same network. Then select your computer's IP address and the tablet will attempt to connect to it. After a few moments, it will show the contents of your computer screen. Ok, but what can you do with a second screen besides viewing content on it? Well, you can use the touch screen if the tablet is a touch screen. I don't know about styluses since I don't own a stylus based tablet. Here's another suggestion. By default, the tablet duplicates the PC display as you will see in a moment. So I will drag this window around and it also appears on your tablet. But it doesn't have to be like this. If you invoke the keyboard shortcut Windows key plus P, you will open the project menu. From there, you can make the tablet extend the PC monitor, which means you can drag a window from the laptop to the tablet. Let me show you if you haven't used a second screen before. I will open a new window and drag it to the left corner, or well, I guess, the right corner since Windows assumes the tablet is on the right side, and then the window will continue onto your tablet screen. You can choose the location of your second monitor in settings. Finally, here's a suggestion in case your tablet can't stand upright. You can buy this type of stand and add the tablet to your desk setup. Thanks for watching the video, I hope it was useful. Please subscribe to the channel and why not watch another video?